<laughs> Trifling ass computer. <laughs> yeah. The American Dent Association it can't tell me no goddamn shit about robots. To select the command menu by pressing the start button. You can save the This ring world run. Fucking Halo. Yeah. Menu. Yeah. Oh, more things I can murder. Right. Let us avoid unnecessary battles. Oh yeah, the whole point is for things to leave. In this area. Obtain the flying mode module from it. I mean the boner mode. Which is what will be called from now on. Boner mode. The green light points to the local server. That was what they called me in college. They called me boner mode. <laughs> is that like all a mode? No. <laughs> it's not. Well, I mean, I guess it could be if you like count something as ice cream. Yeah, something similar. Yeah. It's not vanilla, but it's close enough. It really isn't, but yeah. <laughs> oh, shit. So they just went all, It's the enemy! I need help! Yeah. You guys are coming after you? Yeah. Oh. It lied to me. I have to go kill a guy to get that. I never doubt about that. <laughs> there it is. I can see that, you idiot. <laughs> that, that giant thing that says passcode? Go get that. Clearly already have access to flying mode. Flying. <laughs> yeah, this is It's me not off. the good flying mode. Jeez. You're you're actually just uh, misusing hovering mode right now. <laughs> oh yeah, I, I didn't finish my thought earlier when I was talking about the opening cutscene. Yeah. Uh yeah, it reminded me of Nights in the Dreams, like the first nights, because like the the beginning of like the male story for that one is identical to how this one starts, except for without robots. Instead, it's like nightmares chasing you. Uh, uh, same lighting, and almost then same character almost. Fall into the dick of a robot? Well, you fall into the dick of a gay jester who flies around and takes you to the dream world. Gotcha, gotcha. So, almost the same. Almost the same thing. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just gonna fight them because it's fun. Before it becomes not fun when they become too fucking strong. Because they will become too tough, too strong. See, those levels do matter. At some point, they're gonna really matter. Okay, so how do I leave? Where's the leave area? Do I have to hit What's start? it indicated by? Area change. That's it. Oh. I forgot. Okay. Flight mode. I mean, boner mode. Alright. I know you're watching the Let's Play channel, but you should have been expecting no, us to say that. Yeah. Well, he shouldn't have lived there. That's also, so when you're out here in flight mode, you can't do this in the second one. So it's kind of nice to be able to do this, like the, like just, it feels good to control Jyoti out in the, like, hub world, basically. Like, you don't have any attacks or anything, you just kind of can float around and just have some fun there. Um, nice. Yeah, it's, it's pretty fun. So I'm gonna, we are entering residential block I'm going to penetrate this town. You are alive, aren't you? With your cock? Hit. No. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> so this is uh one of the bosses that's not the the girl. A virage. Father. <laughs> what? It's no a legend activity. of dragoon thing. <laughs> oh. Dead? That is a possibility, but it is more natural to assume the residents were previously evacuated. Oh yeah, another thing about this one that's kind of I'm really glad they got rid of it. I detect because this one is activity. full of escort missions and like subject. don't let people die missions, yeah. which are going to be the ones that are going to make me fucking like punch so myself in the dick with a knife. Do you know yeah. this person? Yes. I recognize them by their uh, low poly hair. Yeah. <laughs> I recognize her by being one of the only things that has color, so it stands out in this world. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> the only the only thing that's not a black Isn't or blue palette. Are you right, Selvis? Leo. Her name is Selvis. <laughs> is that you, Leo? 
which what are you doing here? What are you doing? I only bring up because the you voice actor, like, like whenever the they say it, just kind of feels weird. Yeah, no, totally. The children may still be in the church, so you're going to the church. They're scared, motherfuckers. Yeah, actually, that is exactly the mission of almost most of this game. You're scared, motherfucker, go to the church. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Forget about them. Did Ice Cube you help Kojima write this? <laughs> <laughs> not dead yet. Ice Cube confirmed. I hope so. Zoe won. <laughs> well, you know how things are with Kojima. Things are always connected. Ice Cube confirmed as a playable character in Metal Gear Solid 5. <laughs> Rising Revengeance. <laughs> <laughs> it's like Ice Cube, a rapper deprived of his. <laughs> I don't know. Tired of your Fred. memes, Ice Cube. <laughs> yeah. Whoa, whoa. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. You're the runner of Bravo. That frame's not a kid's toy. Get I'm a mushroom it. man. Yeah, right. He's piloting I'm a mush, fucking mush, mush, throwing out my spores out here, alone. I'm a mushroom man. He's like, ah, oh, yeah. Yeah, kid. You're supposed to murder me. He thinks he can toy with you. He's like, he's gonna kill you and take his, uh, take your mech. Yeah. So, he's not really, he's, he's pulling his punches because he thinks it's funny. Until you start kicking his ass. Yeah. Also, I'm kind of cheesing it a little bit. I'm gonna get up close to him and hit him for real. Not now, though. That was bad. That was a bad move. <laughs> <laughs> Well, I'm so down on health. That was a lie, because you're not. I'm used to playing this on, on hard mode in the uh, number two, so I'm used to just not trying to get hit by anything ever. Yeah, yeah. So, yeah. <laughs> Come on, are you giving up? Come on, kid. Oh, he has a, oh, I here. can't get close to him. I forgot he has a barrier or some kind. Oh, ah. never mind. So I gotta, I do gotta cheese it. Ah. Also, I love the Pandra Dragoon. <laughs> it sounded like he farted. Yeah, I, I really. Hey, internet! It sounded like he farted. <laughs> <laughs> Slap that dislike button. <laughs> <laughs> But yeah, I with games like this, I gotta say, like one of my favorite things, and I'm really glad it's in this game, is I've always been a big fan of homing lasers. They don't make any sense. Yeah. Homing lasers make no sense, but I love watching lasers curve into the enemy. Like that's fucking cool. So now the, the gloves are coming off. Yep, kid gloves are coming off. Whatever the fuck that's supposed to mean. Y'all niggas know what, what I'm about. about. Niggas go when the gloves come off. The gloves come off. Alright. How about this? You flaming idiots! Take this! You flaming idiots! Take this! <laughs> you just you just punched a ball and it's Cock. Pit. Yes, Nathan. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> oh, shit. That was not smart. Welcome to youtube.com slash basement quality, where we are children. <laughs> We're better than children. We're grown men acting like children. <laughs> we are man children. Not here. Yeah, not here. Pulls out a Chaos Emerald. It all starts with this. <laughs> a jewel containing the ultimate power. <laughs> Is this my grandfather's legacy? Orbital frames? <laughs> Sonic, what are you doing inside of this fucking bank vault that's like deep below... I, I, I kind of feel like like Robotnik would totally have an orbital frame at some point. 
basically does in like Sonic Rush. Like he'd just come on screen with this giant like Gundam. It's kind of what the mech at the end of Sonic 3 and Knuckles is. I guess so, yeah. It just Shit. seems too massive. Oh, yeah. Oh, I guess maybe he's, he's like guarding that too much. I'm not sure what tactic I need to use, because there's something I should be doing and I'm not doing. Well, maybe if you get Grog up next to it. You'll get support. Oh, I need to hit him when his head is poking out. Oh, okay. Yeah, he's he's not gonna budge right now. I'm just gonna have to be smart. Wait it out, dig it deeper, only to throw it away. Yeah, that's how you do it. Oh, <laughs> oh. <laughs> My robot's been kaboshed by this underclassman. I'll make sure that no girl goes to the prom with you, Jehuti. Oh, <laughs> my money's on fire. <laughs> Bullshit, yes. Okay, I was like, you better be dead. <laughs> you yeah, that like magic Daigo pixel. Mahara pixel thing. Yeah. yeah. I actually kind of came kind of close to dying there. That was no good, but you know. ETR reaction yeah. from the target. Its main generator has ceased to function. We did it. I detect vital activity yeah, within the target. It appears that occupants are still alive. I am releasing the lock-on cursor. Target will be destroyed. Destroy it? Why? They can't fight anymore. Your question does not compute. Why not destroy it? Why should I kill when there's no reason to? I compute 17 clear reasons for such a <laughs> I like it. <laughs> I like it, it's like specifically 17. Access to another orbital frame and returning to battle at another time and place. Shut up! I refuse to destroy it. What's the point of attacking those who have no intention of attacking but they... us? Do you wish it's a me to bit on the nose, but all right. Father. I have yeah, to conclude that your reaction I think it's a story for these aren't the greatest, but... Illogical actions by persons without sufficient capabilities make it very difficult to fulfill the mission. You mean I'm not good enough to do this, so I should just shut up and obey orders? That is the most sensible course. So you say... Target approaching limit of our... Yeah, also the dick flies off. Remaining. <laughs> the dick flies you off. You speak like yeah. a human, but yeah. you're still a heartless computer, aren't you? That is correct. What is the problem? Come at me, bro! Yeah! You started it! What's up? What's up? What's up? I detect several mass produced orbital frames behind us. They are in the vicinity of the church. What? Zombies? Oh, Enemy with a real. I don't like this program. mission if I remember. Be careful. Oh, jeez. <laughs> this game really. Kojima yeah. really wanted you in on the story. <laughs> Fuck that thing. For the These Titans. Bitch. Isn't my car really cool? You wanna like go to space prom? <laughs> Give you a space kiss. It's the dirtiest of all kisses. <laughs> 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 Do with your butts. Now I can do my <laughs> space taxes. And <laughs> Everything is raunchier in space. <laughs> Everything is just space when it is done in space. Yep. Yeah. It's not just doing your taxes. It's, it's like, all right, welcome back. As you can see, the map here they actually give you the enemy patterns of their movements, ah. which is really cut, really cool. Very Metal Gear. Yeah. If only it was on a mini map in the corner instead. Yeah. We have obtained the Metatron ore. Damage to the surroundings increasing due to battle. We will hold battle position. This is pretty sweet though, like it just yeah. feels I mean when we're all done here I can let you play a little bit, or I can leave it here so you can play. You want. No, it's okay, I have I have these games on PS2. 
but I never played them. Yeah, they feel really good when you, like, master it. Oh, I just got a new weapon, actually, from beating that guy. Uh, I actually want to change to it. Uh, which... Do you have to, like, cash it in or something, or do you just... Yeah, I think I might have to actually... Oh, maybe I don't. Wait, go back and go down to passcodes. So Jevlin, oh, I don't have the driver. I have the passcode to get the driver. Yeah, uh -oh. that, that's what I meant. Yo, you're right. Yeah, yeah. I, I forgot this game. The rules are a little bit different. In the second one, they just kind of just give it to you when you want it, like when you need when you like kill the thing, add it. Got it. Okay. But yeah, a lot, for a lot of the beginning of this game, I'm gonna like probably just get into like random combats a lot more on purpose, just because they're like just fun, it's just fun to do. Yeah, but yeah. later in the game, I'm gonna be mad when I get into combats because I don't want to fight everything because it's too hard. Yeah, yeah. Uh, <laughs> I mean, like with any game, this kind of can be said about anything. But I mean, this one is that is exactly what my thought like, process will be. I remember playing Final Fantasy VII and being like. Like, every time the screen goes, Poosh, I'm just like, ah, oh, god damn it. Yeah, because the encounter rate in some places in that game is so damn high. Yeah, that and, like, it, the transition is so long, and, like, I just want to... I, I, I'm not in an interesting part of the game at, the, at that point. Yeah, you're, like, in those caves where you fight the zombies or some shit. Yeah. Where you're, like, doing Red 13s like thing. Yeah. We will cease battle position. We are heading for the outer area of the battle zone. Oh, there, there it is. I found it. I nice. found it down there. So, yeah. Then cash that in down there. And, and you get Fulbin mode. <laughs> Fulbin! Laser! Laser! Drill! That's what this game needs. It needs that announcer <laughs> for all the weapons. Javelin! <laughs> Alright, so now I can just go up and down just like Metal Gear style, change them out. Okay, sweet. And let's just try Javelin out on somebody. So that's a new gun? Yep, it has ammo though. Some of the weapons have ammo. Well, we all have a friend and mine is a G-U-N, my buddy. My buddy. My buddy. Wherever I go, you go, my buddy. If only we could replace this really cool robot high-speed robot action music with freaking my buddy by with 50 <laughs> If only you could replace Jehuti with Yayo. with the kid being <laughs> driven by 50 Cent. No, 50 Cent would be driven by this kid. He'd just be inside his dick. And, and he'd just be running around. Going, Motherfucker. A bitch. A bitch. <laughs> like, at Ada is 50 Cent. <laughs> uh, what's the mission right now? Well, Ada is G-Unit. Uh, oh, I guess I killed everybody. So I guess oh, I'm yep, good. yeah, squad zero. Yep. So I can just leave, I think. Unless squad Splocka. <laughs> squad Splocka! Oh, she's just in my ship. Oh, she getting in there earlier. Yeah. Okay, yep. sorry. I Are you forgot. alright? Are you hurt? Are you hurt everywhere? No. Why so are we in this robot's dick, Leo? No. <laughs> Because so of this the is the cockpit. cockpit. <laughs> <laughs> God, it's so funny. I yelled at you too. But one thing that I want you to Oh, this verbal abuse. You have to take care of your own life too. I understand. You did manage to escape. Didn't you, father? He can't hear you. You're in a fucking robot. Also, he's nowhere nearby. Yeah. He's dead also. Yeah. What is Wasn't there a Call of Duty thing where there are a whole bunch of people in a Look, church that are shooting at other guys and you're in a giant plane? Yeah. I, I don't know. I don't remember. I didn't play that much Call of Duty. Or something like that. They're like, do not fly on the church because I'm British. Yeah. Just don't fall yeah. my cock, so... I like, the sil I like how the silhouette of Joji has a huge dick. <laughs> yeah. I want my silhouette to just have that attached to it. <laughs> yep, you need to get Escape to Mars on the uh, Antilles. You need to get your ass to Mars? Yes. Get you, that's actually the mission, pretty much. Get your ass to Mars. Sweet. 
Unfortunately, we need more detailed information about the colony. That will require returning. So to it looks like there are a bunch of like end, dust particles on that penis. Yeah, I blow them off. And, I, yeah. I recently played a game called Strike Suit Zero, and it's a lot like this, but this looks more fun. Yeah, it's a really fun game. Like it's it holds up seriously. Like, yeah. The cutscenes, eh, but I think just you ought to try Strike Suit Zero because it's definitely in the same vein as this. Oh yeah. Try it. Not necessarily. I know. I know. I, was, I yeah. Anyone watching this, try it out. You might like. Baram forces are still attacking Antilia as part of their invasion. Rescue workers have begun attempts to save patients in the destroyed hospital. But a fierce fire is still raging, and workers are having difficulty gaining access. All those poor people can do is wait for the release of death. Oh. That's all for now. <laughs> Tonight at 11. <laughs> Wap, dap, dee, will it boop? Listen, Leo. Can't you help those people? No. no. Just like you helped me. Can't you do that for them, too? Allow me to interrupt. As I stated earlier, you should not undertake illogical actions that have no bearing on our mission. But just for a little while. But we kick logic to the curb. And all aboard do the impossible. To <laughs> row, row, in order to complete our mission, we should not engage in any other activities. Oh, I see. Also, judging from the capabilities of the frame runner, the risk rate for such an illogical action is very high. Ada, where is that hospital? Leo, I will pinpoint. It's great about this. A this is a skybox. But I must repeat. You should not yeah, it's so good looking. That yeah. Have no bearing on your mission. Yes, I know all that. I just asked. I'm scared. But even too. now, like it's crazy. Yeah. Like I know it's HD, but still, like S O S. Yeah. You'll send an S O S to the world. Oh, actually, did I go to? Did I did I not go save those people? Can I actually do that? Because I don't remember if you have to go save them or something. Because I know I have to come here again to get some information about the colony. Now we will head for the local server to transplant the necessary information. But first, we need to destroy the enemy with the passcode for oh, the local there is. server. I see. The star marked frames show the leaders. Uh -huh. Destroying the leader first will lower the level of the entire party. Yeah. The robots in this in this uh, universe can like link up their AI and form a party, which makes it so they can like make tactics and fuck you up really bad. So if you don't kill the leader, they're like, the combat's very tough. But I isolated this one guy from the group, so I think I might be okay, actually. Good. That's the way to be. When that says javelin on it, does that mean use the javelin on it? Uh, I think it just might be ammo. Okay. Yeah. Javelin kind of sucks. It I don't, seems to, yeah. I yeah. don't like it. Yeah. I don't know if anybody else has gotten it to work better, but I don't remember ever getting it to work that great. I think I think on bosses it worked pretty good, because, like, big things. Yeah. I've had less trouble hitting, but... Colony damage increasing due to battle. So, I got the thing, so I guess I can just leave. No, it's the passcode. I need to find the, uh... Yeah. The doodad. The thing to show Find the ATM. Into. Uh. Find the AT and T. Sponsored by... <laughs> so many of those companies merged, I don't know if they're actually at and <laughs> Dude, I have no idea. I've never known. No, Sprint and Verizon, I think. Use the same towers. I think they merged, maybe. I don't know. Whatever. It's not important. I don't know why I'm talking about it. <laughs> that thing. Those are mummy heads. Okay. Uh, they actually can that thing robots. looks like the most like the Liberty Bell of anything I've seen oh, so yeah. far. I think the reason they call them mummy heads is because they like throw out these ropey strands onto the other fucking robots <laughs> and they heal them. I'm not kidding, you, they do. You can 
definitely tell you watch Best Friends. When you, you can. Say shit like you that. You can tell I watch them. <laughs> I don't give a shit. People can know that. <laughs> like, I, know. I don't. No, give... I mean that's hilarious because I. I mean, obviously I do too. Yeah. And in fact, we're watching them right now. <laughs> like we're playing the game, and it's like on the background. Yep. Oh, uh, that'd be weird. That'd be a whole new level of just, like, bullshit. <laughs> what I do sometimes is watch them do a playthrough. I do a playthrough of the same game and just try to do every action they do exactly. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> just, just like, you know, if they're doing their uh, thing, we just do it too. Uh, where the hell is the... Do I have to go through that hole in the ground that I came out of before? You're looking like a fool with a hole on the ground. It's not on the map. Did I... Javelin... Chili info. I think that's all I need, I guess. Hmm. Okay, let's go back. Sorry if I missed important dialogue and didn't notice, because that just happens during Let's Plays. You just fuck up. Yeah. Forget shit. Too busy talking about jizz and buttholes. Dude, those mummy heads throw so much jizz into my butthole. They sure did. But no joke, that's like what they do. They like throw this like white shit. I don't even know what it is. <laughs> and it like heals other robots. It's weird. Shit. So you gotta kill those like first. The enemy is using the EPS to form a barrier. A microwave energy field in the sky over the colony. So they're gonna cook Maybe us dangerous? like popcorn. <laughs> Being within the energy field. Two I minutes and thirty seconds. <laughs> gonna cook that colony. Much damage, but any vital life <laughs> form popcorn not shrimp. Leo. <laughs> 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 I love Zorak. <laughs> I love the Brack show. Yeah. Fuck. Nay, like. But just fuck any other show. God, I, all other shows suck in comparison to the Brack show. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, what other shows have a dad? A no mom. other show has both of those things. A Brack? <laughs> Not leave it to Beaver. Yeah. What other shows have a Thundercles? I'll tell you how many. Target. The Brack you Show. Also, get used to the word shaft. They're going to say it like a thousand oh, yeah. times. Well, like, that shaft is actually saying. just a nose with like two fingers going into either nostril. <laughs> <laughs> Stop picking your nose. Stop picking your nose, Nigel. Stop I'm, it. I'm going to be a cock. That was a I don't Johnny know. Python Let's thing I was Oh doing. shit, was it? Uh, I was not itching it, I was scratching it. It's like a Brian. Oh, no, you're right, it is. <laughs> God damn it, I'm so mad I didn't pick up on it. I just thought we were doing, like, Fall well, Cock Guy. Most of the time, he'd be safe to assume that. I know, but... I know, but the city's right over there. Oh, I know, I, Also, but... I can go save towns, I guess. So let's try it one time. Yeah. Okay. One time for your motherfucking mind. And if it's something I don't like doing, I'm just gonna stop doing it. I'm just gonna go straight <laughs> to the city, because honestly, the escort missions and the saving people thing suck. I trust you, so we can go straight to the city. <laughs> wow, this is quite the bender they were on. Yeah. 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 Sir Gearder. We've all been there, right? You get wasted, you crash your mech into a residential neighborhood, and you kill the neighborhood dog. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. The, the, the neighborhood dog. The dog that the neighborhood shares. <laughs> the communal dog. Sometimes I say things and I don't realize how hilarious they are until right after I said them. That's <laughs> stupid. That is. Like every the neighbor gets one dog. Okay. It's one of those really anal fucking retentive. Uh, gated communities. Oh, yeah, one of those anal neighbors. Yeah, those I know those. <laughs> <laughs> Remember that movie, Anal Neighbors? <laughs> I love the part where they take out the Bible black and they start doing some fucking shit with that dog. <laughs> the neighborhood dog, in fact. Let's take that Everyone's dog been out. in that Damn. dog. <laughs> Everyone in the town has had a piece of that dog. <laughs> 